we don't have to get rid of you, but you're kind of making this hard for some of our people. For example, Nick how am I making it hard? He, he. No, not you personally. Your little group of merry, merry dudes. Yeah. How are we yeah, making it hard? Uh, we well, offered you trade. It seems like and you've gone back on it. Never mind that. Never mind that. It seems like you yeah. didn't listen to him about your little Jack guy or James, whatever did they did. Jack to him. and James is two different people. James is always around me. Yeah, yeah, He's yeah. He's probably yeah, watching yeah, you I, right I, now. I, I don't care. I'm just waiting for Working the shots that blows now. your brains out. <laughs> oh. So, uh, how is he, how is he watching us? How is, how, how does he fucking know that we are here? That, that surprised me. Because he always watches my back. He's never uh, far away. Oh, he always watches your back. So what was he doing when we, when we took you hostage back there, huh? What was he doing there? Probably waiting. Did he, did he fall asleep? Did he fall asleep? I think, yeah. He was probably waiting for reinforcements. You know, two against one, never a good thing. Yes. Well, yeah, yeah. if he if he fucking shows up, I'm gonna put a bullet in between your eyes. So we make it that clear. Oh, it's clear. Okay. Hands on your head. No, well, listen. I wouldn't. I would never take you hostage if you if you didn't. You know, you 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 were the only one that was in the camp at this time. So, if there was Jack guy. I would, I would take Jack guy and leave you the fuck alone, you know? I have nothing personal to you. Well, it certainly it's just personal. that you were at the, at, at the, at the, at the, at the bad moment in that time, you know? And on the bad point. So, uh, what what do we want to do with him, huh? I think he should send a message to his people not to mess with us again. And well, that he's, gonna, no he's, gonna, he's gonna... He's gonna send a double message because, uh, I'm just gonna take off everything you got so I don't break your fucking glasses, okay? There you go, fucking idiot. Ah, what was that for? Oh, you want more? You want me to? I have done you nothing to, to you. you black eye? Have I? Have I done anything to you? No. Oh, fucking hell! <laughs> How about, how about I make, make you a little... <laughs> oh. There's no need for that. Oh. Oh. You okay, man? No, 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 no,
Mm. An animal. Mm. Yeah, you can't get away with this. Mm. Uh, you want to? You want some to? Huh? I'd, 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 I'd pass on that. Thank you. <laughs> Fuck you! Come on, man. <laughs> but we feel good. You fucking bastard. Now that will happen times a thousand or more to you or whoever we catch if they mess with us okay. again. Okay. Get back on your knees, get back on your knees, come on, back on your knees. Okay, come on, get up. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> There's no need for this. Sadist. All right. You can you can you can fix yourself up. It wasn't that bad. <laughs> What like do you think? Your legs. Yeah. My fucking, my fucking hand. So, so, listen to me, okay now? Fuck. Clear your eyes. You're not gonna cry in front of me, no? <laughs> so, you are gonna run back to your little camp and tell everybody that they will not fuck with us, okay? No one will. Where's your name so I remember it? I shall burn it on my brain. Are you well, enough to give me your seems name? Like, seems like I'm the only one Russian here. So you can tell them that Nikolai is always watching. Nikolai, I will remember that name. <laughs> okay, now get up on your fucking foot and run back to your fucking camp. Come on, go. What about me? Go! You, you run. are gonna die. What about me, man? I am going Turn to around you. and go. You got three seconds. If I see you around, you will be shot. If I see you, if I see you around, oh. you will be shot.
Just having one of them days. I need to sit down again. I'm feeling very lightheaded at the moment. It's not been a good day. Harvey, are you okay? Just still feeling a little lightheaded, Scully. My shoulder hurts, my finger hurts. Painkillers aren't touching it. <coughs> I just can't re run around too much. And the shock of seeing this uh, young lady in the corner just uh, made me go a bit funny. No disrespect. Wow, well, I knew I had an effect on people, but that's a new one. It's just all, you're the dead all man black. walking, huh? That is correct. I am Scully, and you? This is friends call me Shadow. I'm Olivia. I'm, uh, I'm sorry, I cannot be happy at this moment to see you. Um, I guess probably told you. Yeah. Uh, on a mission here today. We are all trying to work out what happened. It is. So they were looking for Jack. Yes. Because Jack pointed a gun at him and told him to clear off from this area. He's came back and uh, decided to take it out on me because I was here it does seem like it was three against one although one of them I don't know whether he was actually part of it or not or what it's still all fuzzy it's I was talking to I still can't remember his name a gentleman about trading some Smirsh vests. He had been to the camp before to talk about Smirsh vest trading. James. And while I was talking to him, I was set upon by two others by the name of Nikolai and Miroslav. Jack. And they held us at gunpoint and took us up into the woods, up to the barren lands where the trees no longer grow. Jack. Where to the going, north. Jack? and handcuffed me but on the way up there the other guy the the trader the backpack trader the vest trader he managed to l run away when we got into a grove of christmas trees right. they lost line of sight on him and he ran away but they didn't seem to care and then when we got to the barren lands, they shouted at him and he came up the hill without his weapon out. They ordered him onto the floor and didn't even bother taking his gun off, which was very suspicious to me. It's like he was there to distract me while they crept up on me. <sighs> and then they tortured me to find out about Jack where he was, who else was here at the camp. They kicked me in the stomach. They punched me in the face. They sliced off my middle finger. And then, because I wouldn't tell them what they wanted, they stuck a knife into my shoulder. I still feel it twisting. And then they stripped me naked again, checked everything that I had in my pockets, took anything I could defend myself with, 
and told me to run back to camp and pass the message on to Jack that they were after him. Lovely group. Sorry. It's just a bit... not nice at all. I hadn't done anything to them. But now, they will pay for that. I have spoken to Graves on the radio and asked him to keep an eye out for them and information. I will pay anything for information because they disappeared straight afterwards. I didn't even have a chance to come back to camp and get a gun to try and seek revenge. Right. James and Scully were already in the woods up north looking for me. But they had disappeared. Nowhere to be seen. Which I find have very strange. Have you hired Graves to bring him in? I have asked Graves for information and if he has to kill them then I will pay him whatever he wishes. But I would prefer to find them myself. I have a score to settle. And I think James... You do. ...wishes to help. Because we are close. And the day started out so well as well. I just don't know at the moment. I realized I do have one thing I can I help you with here. Uh, I did yeah. lose I, I did lose blood, you may. I believe you are trustworthy and I thank you for that. We seem to have lost all of ours when probably they raided our Looks medical good. supplies. All of our salines disappeared. Thank you. Hope that helps. Whew. The light shines a bit brighter. The world looks a bit fresher. I do have a second IV. Use it. I don't think I lost that much blood. They did... I will give them that. They did bandage me straight away afterwards. They just wanted to inflict the pain, I think. And scar me. Not physically. But they have scarred me both ways, I think. I don't think... I can be carry on the way I was. Did you hear that? You just hear some... yeah. Cover shadow. James. Sound resume. James.
James, Jack, Scully. I don't think you any of them are the radio. I don't think any of them are on, dude. Was that you, Graves, whistling? Oh. Somebody was whistling. It wasn't okay. me or Shadow. I'll be there soon. Drop off some stuff. Won't be long. You still here, Jack? You're Graves. I am, I'm watching. Oh. You, you. I'm still here, James. He's dead. Don't kill the, the, the fucking... Jack killed himself. Out of nowhere. Jack what? Just killed himself. Out of nowhere. What the fuck? Where? In the middle of the camp. In the middle of the camp. Knifed himself. I'm ahead of here, man. Good luck. I need to sort this shit out. What the hell? You're, ask you're, you're asking, you're asking you're me what the hell. I have no idea. Do you do it because of what happened? Do you feel responsible? Wait, wait, there's a hunting backpack for you. <coughs> Jesus Christ, what the hell? Graves. Guys, the only thing I know, he was reading this book. Yeah, I, I don't And he was laughing. Crashed. And that's it, that's... Seven leagues under the sea. Yeah, it's in French version. Never heard about that one. Oi, Jack. What? I don't understand, I really don't. See, because he believes it was his fault that I got taken? No one, no, no one knows, really. He was laughing, I heard him laughing, then I just heard, next thing was, I heard everybody saying, what and what the fuck. Killing himself make, won't make them go away. Why? 
Bye, Jack. User left your channel. Buddy left your channel. You had a defibrillator for me in there? Oh, Jesus Christ. Jeez, Jack. Can't leave him like this. You get a shovel. We need to bury him. I don't understand. Fucking camp is going out of his mind. James. Rest easy, my friend. Buddy joined your channel. I'll never forget the times we had. These fucking Russians. They're gonna pay for everything. Liked it over by the lake. I'm gonna put him over by the lake. Same thought as me. I'll go get him. James, 
we have a spot ready for him. Sorry my friend, but it's the only way I can carry you. I can't stand to see your body like this. Bible in the tent. Can you have a look in the library? Yeah. Will you join us, Shadow? I've had one too many suicides. I'm just gonna sit here. I understand. I understand. Jack wasn't the most religious religi person. No Bible. I'm not that religious myself, but. Say some words. It was his favourite spot overlooking the lake. I don't know what to say, but yay. Though I walk through the shadow here, the shadow of death, I shall fear no evil. Thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Ashes to ashes. Amen. Ashes to ashes dust to dust. You will be greatly missed, my friend. Bow our heads. Remember Jack as he was. Slightly eccentric, but always our friend. May he rest in peace. I shall cover the grave. Man, first complete piece, my brother.
peace with you with you, brother. Buddy joined your channel. Bobby. Right over here. Bobby, you got everybody a little worried, but more I can take today. Everybody's jumpy, everybody's hearing things. Don't know what to do. All I know is I want to kill somebody. Well, Bobby, I can tell you, you, uh, you're strong. Oh. They will pay. Yeah, you're strong. You're you're like a another gentleman I know. A man that taught me what I know today. You remind me a lot of him. They took through this. They took my finger and now they've taken my friend. We're gonna get through this. We will have our revenge. Oh, damn! We're straight. gonna show them this. We're gonna show them that we're not weak. Maybe it's time to uh, have a talk with James. You said he was going a little mad on the way he was. I think it's time we listen to him. That's right. I just see someone running around, Sir Livia. Shadow. I just wanted to be by myself for a little while, that's all. I need to think clearly. I'm not going to do anything. I'm not going to do what Jack did. There's people that has to die first before I die. Yeah. James is over there looking for you, so... Just let him know I'm okay. I'll let him... I will. And... I'm just... Trust me, my friend. We will get our revenge. I'm fine. He 
Jake got out of the car and all he said was, I'm free, I'm free. And he's free now. Not having to put up with this world anymore. His legacy. I never forgot. His legacy is the library in the tent behind us. Last bastion of civilization. He had a mission to carry, collect all the books that were left. I'm going to carry on that mission. With the help of others, of course. Yeah. Any books I've run across. They will be brought back. Always. He was a good man. He will be sorely missed. can't sit here in Pine Room and feel this way. We still have lots to do in this godforsaken land. And we must carry on. He would want us to. What preparation do we need to make? I feel comfortable with it. At the moment, I just want to kill something. I think I might head down into town and take my uh, frustrations out on some of the undead. Some practice. Sounds like a plan. Get some practice yep. in.